Hello again. In this video, our art studio will show you how to make this chandelier step by step at home with minimal resources. These plastic night lamps with batteries can be purchased from an industrial goods store or a home goods store. In this case, we will not need their stand. Of this, we will use only the upper oval part. For the three avoid bodies of our chandelier, we will need a total of six upper oval parts of lamps. From the wooden board, the thickness of our is 3 cm or 30 mm. Of course, you can choose another size. We cut three rings with a diameter slightly larger than the diameter of the bottom of the oval part of the lamp. The upper part of the lamp that we will use consists of an oval part and a bottom, which are clamped to each other with a mechanism. Here is the bottom. It separates from the oval part. Then, the middle part of it is cut in a circle. There are six plastic rings left, with a diameter slightly smaller than that of the wooden rings. Here you can see the bottom cutted out from it a plastic ring. The middle cutted off part of it that we don't need and the wooden ring with attached to it on both sides with screws plastic rings. For one egg-shaped body of the hanging chandelier, we use a wooden ring, two plastic rings and two oval pieces. We show how we'll use the oval parts. The one that will be placed on the underside of the wooden ring is left intact. In the second one, which will be on top, is made an opening with a diameter in which to be entered the socket of the pendant. You see the result of everything described and done so far. In the cable of the pendant, we inserted a wooden bow to be at the top of the socket. We bought the bow ready. We used the socket of the pendant and now we will use its upper part. Cut off the top of the pendant. Where it is cut, smoothed it with sandpaper as shown. Then, on the board already drilled in three places, we glue the cut part. We pass the three cables of the pendants through them. Between the wild plastic cups, drilled two more holes in the board. The chandelier will be attached to the ceiling through them. The length and thickness of the board is optional. At the back of the board we have carved grooves for the cables to enter and connect. We close these grooves with plastic caps, which we fasten with screws to the board. Here is the finished hanging chandelier. This is how it looks mounted. I hope you like it. Good luck, goodbye.